Hi, welcome to Say Art News. This is Art Caster Luha. Let's take a quick look at how art you're doing this week. Here comes K Art News first. A group exhibition is currently on view at Gallery Troy until August 25th. The exhibition introduces over 50 works by 22 emerging young artists under the theme of youth. All emerging artists between the ages of 20 and 30 were chosen by Gallery Troy through social media. 22 artists were chosen from among many to represent the meaning of 2022. The Seoul Museum of History jointly presents the exhibition with the Hungarian Museum of Ethnography. The exhibition, Story of My Day, shows photos taken from Hungary. Through photographs, visitors can glance into Hungarian children's daily lives in 1936 and 2021. One of the most renowned artists in South Korea is the artist Lee jung Seop. His distinctive painting and drawing techniques were admired by many collectors. The National Museum of Modern and Contemporary Art exhibited 90 of his works, including Chicken and Chicks and Children Playing in the Water. The works are opened for the first time for the public. And among 90 artworks on display, 80 works are from the donated collection of the late Lee Gun Hee, chairman of the Samsung, and 10 works are owned by museum. Now it's time for the international news. Here we go. One of the largest marketplaces for art, Sotheby's, will host a live auction in Singapore for the first time in 15 years. For the first auction, a lineup will be heavily weighted toward Southeast Asia to Singapore. Through this live auction, Sotheby hopes to stagger the growth of local collectors and diversify the market. Furthermore, the auction will broaden its activities beyond Hong Kong and mainland China as well. Alright, this is all I have for today and I'll be back with more How Art You Doing next time. Say Art News, Luha. Mm-hmm.